Mike, it's estimated up to 20% of Americans come down with seasonal flu each year. The virus can be serious and potentially deadly. Last flu season, less than half of Americans were vaccinated, yet health experts agree it's critical to get a flu shot every year. Here to help us differentiate between the flu and the common cold, Dr. Kim Tran and Beth Badalino, a registered nurse and CEO of Healthy Women. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, Kim, what is the difference or the differences, what are they, between seasonal influenza and the common cold? Well, the cold and the flu actually are very similar. They have similar symptoms. Major difference between the two would be with the flu, you get a fever. So if you do experience a fever, most likely you're coming down with the flu. And like you mentioned, it, it can be more severe. The symptoms can be more severe with the flu. Who is most at risk? Everybody's at risk for getting the flu. However, we want to focus on the really young and the really old because their immune systems are a little bit weaker and they can have the serious complications related to the flu. I mean, more than 200,000 people per year are hospitalized because of those flu-related complications, which is a huge number. Why is it so important to get a flu vaccine each year? It's important to get it each year because each year the flu vaccine is different. It does cover more strains or more, most popular strains. And Beth, I know you have some recommendations about um, ways to stay healthy during the flu season. What are they? You know, it's all about prevention. So hand washing, hand washing, hand washing um, is <laughs> yeah. so important. But besides hand washing, you can, you know, proper diet, exercise, getting enough sleep to keep your immune system nice and strong and then get the flu shot. And there's no reason not to get the flu shot. Your local pharmacies are now offering flu shots. You can go in and your pharmacist can give you the flu shot. So it's so easy. And again, we can't stress it enough. Um, it's a great way to prevent the flu. Are all flu vaccines the same? I know you said they, they evolve based on the evolution of the virus itself, but in terms of shots, are they all the same? They're actually not. While the CDC recommends a flu shot for pretty much everybody over six months, there's not one shot for everybody. There are different options out there. You have the high dose for the elderly. We have a preservative free, and there's also cell-based option for patients with certain allergies. And for people so like- So talk to your health provider. Yeah, and, and for people like my husband who are convinced that getting the flu shot will give him the flu, <laughs> right? And I'm like shaking <laughs> him every year, like you don't get it. Uh, is, is, is he right or am I right? No, you actually cannot get the flu from the flu shot. Flu shots are inactivated viruses. You know, dead viruses can't give you the flu. And now something that people may not know is that it takes two weeks for the flu shot to work. So within that two week window, you can still get sick when you're around someone who was already sick. So give it that two weeks for it to work. And like Beth said, you know, prevent it. Wash your hands during those mm -hmm. two weeks so you don't get sick. Is there a website where you can our viewers? Sick people. Yeah. <laughs> Is there one site where you, you want our viewers to follow up online? You know, we'd love your viewers to visit healthywomen.org for great flu prevention tips and the cdc.gov backslash flu for more information on flu. That's right. Prevent it. Let's stay healthy. Thank you both for joining us today. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.